Oh, colony ship and a trade ship. Okay, uh, trade ship, what can you sell me? A massive storage. There's an achievement for that, actually. Uh, should I grab that? 660, though. 65% commission. Ouch. Problem is, they never bring more than one of these special blueprints at once, so... Eee, dear. Uh, can I actually trade for that? I'd have to start selling off my actual processed materials. Get that. I need my processed materials, though. Because I need to build a farm. Um, oh, this is a conundrum, isn't it? No, wait, no, it's not. When have I cared about um, my people's well-being over expanding my power and influence? I have not. So, sell off all the stuff that they need again. Trading the future against the present. Though, actually, the, the entire point is I can't, I can't raise that much. Dismiss it. Go away. Leave me. You have made me bitter in my own inability, so... A pox on you. A pox on you, I say. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, loyal robots. The robots are all I can ever truly depend on. <laughs> oh, what a mean-spirited thing to say. Okay. Speaking of the robots, let's actually build a robot bay for once, shall we? Let's build a... No. I just mentioned I need a farm because I need more food, so... Why would I do that? Let's get a farm out here to continue expanding the base in that general direction. But I need some in interconnecting domes and things along here as well to actually allow better passage. So I guess I need one. Uh, hmm. Tell you what, let's just build that there. That's a very large dome. It requires eight of both materials. I've got that. Hello, Colin Chip. How is my prestige doing at the moment, actually? And I've, I've, I've lost track. Let's have a look. Uh, decent. Okay, they are not entirely happy, but they are still doing stuff. Isn't there a monument or something I can build? Monolith requires pyramid. What? Pyramid requires signpost. What? Signpost requires metal and shows colony information. Hmm. Okay. Oh, that, that, that laser gun's online. It's charging up now. Doesn't require much power, but it's um, slow firing. But that will keep this entire area safe. As long as my telescope actually detects it, though. Mm. Eh. Oh, whatever. The farm is the important thing right now. Come on, you slackers. Make me more metal. There's no one mining, at all. Bunch of lazy, lazy blooming slackers. Oh, hey, no oh dear. Slackers, slackers. How dare you treat me this way. Bunch of slackers. I swear, this colony is full of slackers. <laughs> I should know, I am one, yes. Well, how else do you explain how things got this bad for my channel? <laughs> okay, let's, uh, let's build a dome here so they can get some more well-deserved rest. Trade ship has landed. Uh, you give me the big solar panels. Hmm. Problem is, I'm still struggling for resources a bit. I don't know. Uh, let's sell off some polymer. Oh, actually, you're, you're lousy commission. No, go away. Go away. Yeah, happiness is a constant issue, and that's slowing down my growth rate again. I really should just concede to their incessant whining, shouldn't I? Blowing space colonists are getting all uppity, thinking they know better than me, their lord and overseer. Ah! Actually, that gives me the theme for this entire flipping run on this game, doesn't it? It's like, um, here, listen to how evil I can be, and how much I... I boss around the downtrodden below me. Yes. That is totally a thing I should do, actually. <laughs> yeah, that's probably going to be entertaining to someone. Yeah. Actually, I know exactly who it's going to be entertaining to. My, my light's going to love it. So, yep. Well, provided they watch the videos. They do, though, so, yeah. I think they'll love this. Century reached. Okay, I've hit 100 people. My base is growing very nicely. Yes, thank you. 
I have a hundred people crammed into this place. And I'm working on cramming in more and more and more. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Um, I should increase my prestige, though. Oh, I have, I have never reached 100 people on this planet. Hmm. I thought I had. Oh, well. Um, oxygen flow seems to be getting to be a slight issue. I can have up to 120 people with my current generators, but I just don't have any nearby. So... Yes. Here you go, people. You can have more beds. Let you all get some more sleep. Actually, I know, I know what I should do to celebrate having 100 people here. To have 100 people here, I shall be gracious. I shall be happy. I shall be your greatest overseer ever. And let other people come down to see and envy. Yes, let them come down and bask in the glory that is our base and your prison. <laughs> yeah, yes, sure. Let's do it that way. Oh, someone's got a broken bone. Aww. Sandstorm approaching soon. Auctions. Yeah, as you can see, things are struggling a bit with the auction front now. I do need to have more auction production going. So let's get an auction dome going over here. Connect it to that one. Um, I could do with another airlock actually out, out this way. So let's build an airlock here too, like that. How's my water doing? Let's see. Uh, here comes the sandstorm. Okay, people, come back in. Be safe. Be happy. Be glad that I care. Hello, big trade ship. Uh, GM onions. That would be a good thing to get, but it's a expensive thing as well. So, actually, what's what's your 65% commission? Oh, ouch. Ooh. That's going to cost me over 600 to grab that. 660. I don't think I can squeeze that much. Ooh. Sell off all my starch. Sell off all my medicine. Oh, wait. I need, I need that right now. Uh, sell off three medicine. Sell off my medicinal plants. Sell off my metal. No, I can't manage that. Dang all. How dare you! How dare you do this to me? Because you see, um, they sell you two plant DNAs, and they basically give you more powerful things to grow in your farms, which produce four things instead of three. So that's again super level things. I can't afford it though. Uh, out of hell with it. I'll be generous and just buy some flipping meals for people. There you go. Have food, you ingracious cretins. Have food. Enjoy. Jeez. But yeah, as you can see, this entire area is suffering from oxygen, so that oxygen generator is very much required. Prioritize that. That's going to be okay. Um, then I'll build a water extractor out here as well to supply and make sure I've got water coming in. Okay, that's gone, so... Okay, you can go out and about now. But yeah, look at that. They're suffering from low oxygen in this corner of the base, because there's... All the oxygen is trying to flow that way, but there's not a direct connection, really. I know the lab's struggling as well. because It's because this is the, bi the core of the base, and these areas have a bunch of people in them, but they are past the rest of it, so... Yeah. Okay, there's a bunch of meals, that'll help out a little bit. I would go and fill that farm with food production, but I actually require these structures first. Oxygen to keep these places stable. An airlock for better access to this general area, because they're coming from over here. And then a water extractor to make sure that everything stays operational. Plus I need the water extractor anyway to, um, in light of the farm expansion I'm about to do. So yeah. 197 power though, ouch. Yes, I know the dorm gets low on oxygen whenever people go to sleep in it. <laughs> I know! I know! Trust me, I know! Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Just build that passage up and there we go. There we go. That's sealed. This laser covers much of the base, but I could do with another one down here, actually. Because I wasn't sure where to put the laser, I expended the, this um, line out, out down here. I think I could put a laser here or something, and I actually need to. But yeah. 
Hmm. Oxygen flow is restored. Water is okay. Yep. Some people are getting very hungry. So I need the food. And of course, since I've got an abundance of people, it's time to put down fast growing food crops to, to feed them all. So lots of tomatoes and lettuce. Since it only counts for variety, vegetable plus meat, that means I don't really have to care about um, the fact I've only got like two different kinds of vegetable being grown. That's a layer of complexity this game could have had, but it doesn't, so yeah. Oh well. Oh hello. You've got tourists surviving. Tourists, what they do is they go into the base and use your facilities. So they'll use your food machines, they'll use your um, drinks, they'll use your exercises, they'll use your beds, things like that. Well, the thing is, they pay you credits directly for everything they do. So they give you monies in return. What's that one? Um, a bigger farm dome. 620 though. So still, ouch, I can't quite do that. Ah. Uh, Still, I'd better be gracious and trade for food stocks, since I'm still a bit short right now. And I've, I've, I'm still making far too much starch. Actually, I just sell off my entire starch stocks, don't I? Yeah. Sell off my starch stocks. Give me money flat for the rest of it. So I've got to build up some money. Oh, there we go. Trade for that. Off you go. Yeah, that'll do. Now the thing is, uh, with a visitor ship, it sits there as long as its visitors are in the base. So they will be s that landing pad is not available. So it's like a trade ship. The trade ship sits there until you give it the resources you're supposed to do. Visitor ship stays there until its people in it decide to leave. So that is a thing. And yeah, people are really getting hungry now. Oh dear. Luckily, they're all just getting their food, so it's going okay. But the problem is basic food supply. Luckily, I've got all of this stuff that's just come online, so that should help. And, oh dear, my water's overtaxed. Mm, there's, there's always something. Always something. You people are never satisfied. You should really learn to create water out of thin air and power from uh, running around in circles, screaming at me because I'm not doing things. Yes, that would solve all of my problems. What do you mean it wouldn't solve all of your problems? I don't care it doesn't solve all of your problems. It'll solve all of my problems and that's that. Hmm. Blumming up starts. <sighs> oh well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I am definitely going a bit peculiar. <laughs> yeah. It's because I'm trying to keep going, keep talking. This is what happens if I keep talking for too long and I've been... I've actually been recording before doing this thing and I'm doing all this in one session as I mentioned before so mm, I'm going a bit cuckoo. Now that said maybe if you guys enjoy me being a bit cuckoo maybe I should actually try to do this more often. <laughs> I don't know. Okay I don't know. Oh I've not got enough biosystems guys because the plants are requiring maintenance. Huh. Okay I wasn't expecting that. Uh, da -da -da. 16, 16, oh geez yeah I've got, I've got Tons of, I've got too many medics, too many engineers, too many guards. Also, my power supply is starting to give out on me again, so let better... Oh, there goes my other robot. Yep, there they go. They played 30 credits for the service which rendered, so good on them. Give me power. Give me power. Can I fit one in here? No. I think I fit one in here though. Yep, that's power, but I require a storage, so just a bouncing that. Can I fit a storage over here? Oh, yes, I can actually. He yes, yes, trade ship, I know. I'm going to fit a small storage in there, cause just, just, you know, make the most of it out of this space, really. I'm going to fit a big storage there, yep. This is going to tighten my metal production for some time. Can I fit a small one in there? No. Okay. That, that's the entire basin filled in now. Anyway, trade ship. Hello, big trade. Ooh, big trade ship. Good commission rate as well. Okay. Hmm. I wish you'd turned up earlier, but anyway. Time to flog things to you. I'm going to sell you the stuff you already carry, just because I want to. Oh, I've actually got a gun. Um, and in return... 
Oh, I actually have told, tried to sell you too much. Uh, what should I hang on to? A couple of medical supplies, yes. A couple of those. Actually. Wait, what am I doing? I can sell you all of that. Yeah, I'm okay. Because of your 35% commission, I forgot about that for a moment. And in return, you'll give me all of this money. Oops. Yeah, as you can see, I'm leaving plenty of money behind. Um, Bioplastic, I can definitely sell you all that. Ooh, not enough, eh? Hmm. I don't want to sell you the food, I don't want to sell you the gun, so... I'm not going to sell you the credits, for obvious reasons, so that means I've got to drop my value. A little bit more... 393 credits. Okay. I just cleaned out my colony to line my coffers. Yep, that's exactly the kind of thing I do. <laughs> Another mark of my excellent management style. And people are really looking really unhappy. Hmm. Uh, maybe I should actually do the things I've been saying I should do and actually be caring about their happiness. But then, why book the trend, eh? Why book the trend? Though, actually, seriously, I, I need to attract more people, so I do need to actually do that. So, To get more minions, I require this last building here, which I've not built. Well, actually, I've not built another one as well. I've not built a robotics facility. What I require is to build a multi-dome. I've built everything else so far, so I've talked about everything else so far in this particular game. But I have not built a multi-dome or a robotics facility. I have built a factory. I had to pause and think about that for a moment. <laughs> yes, I have. Since I'm making spare parts and things, I have built a factory. Um, anyway, yeah, a multi-dome. A multi-dome is basically a big leisure slash exercise area. That's what it does. Leisure and exercise. Just plug it in there. And that means it's got lots of... It's got things like running wheels and hanging bars and just seats to sit back and relax in, like the slackers that these people are, and, you know, all that kind of thing. So, that's what this base really needs, because people are getting unhappy, they're getting stressed out. They don't seem to like my constant demands that they do whatever the hell I say whenever I say. Hello, visitor ship. So, yeah, I guess they could use a, a slight reward, and I'll get them running in circles, just for my amusement. Of course. <laughs> oh, yes, no. It's it's for their benefit, obviously. Uh, you've got something I want, but 50% commission is always a nasty one. Uh, not quite ready to do that, so... No, go away. Oh, yeah. Well, Laser just took out an incoming meteor. I'm proud of you, Mr. Laser. Good on you. Oh, and you do this again. I should probably build an extra laser here, probably. I'm sure there's some serious overlap, but they'll help protect each other as well, so probably a good idea. And look, another visitor ship. 15 credits for services rendered. Okay. People aren't starving, so... Whoop. No! One of my security guards died. Yep, I could definitely use an extra laser and some more telescopes and things. And because of that, that room got disconnected and the entire place just suffocated. <laughs> yeah. No, wait, the connection got knocked out, then that room suffocated. And... <laughs> yep. Bit of a mess. Oh, well. I do need to step up my defensive efforts a bit. Got two more biases and personnel just turned up. So, good for them. I'm, I'm hurting for steel, actually. Wait, what? Why am I hurting for steel? It's because my miners are all slacking off again, isn't it? Yeah. How many miners do I even need? 3, 6, 9, 12? 20. I need 20 workers to even man everything I've got right now. How many have I got? 22. Ah, that's why. During the night, they're all slacking off and sleeping. <laughs> I could definitely do some more workers. Uh, 15 guards, that's okay. 16 medics, that's absolutely fine. 16 engineers, yep, that's way too much. But I require a lot of workers, and I still require some... I, I require a few more bioassistant personnel, but mostly workers.
Yeah. Okay. 20 credits. Off you go. Bye bye. And anyway, that's going to build up really soon. The workers are starting to go back to work, I think. Oh, my drill bot's dead. No. That sucks. And but the bar's actually getting really busy. But this food down here seems to have solved my food supply problems quite nicely. Because I'm actually building up a storage of them. And an absolute ton of bioplastics again. Ah. Oh. I should probably do something about that. Uh, let's see, let's get this one actually populated with medical bays, so... You can make lots and lots and lots of beds, and drugs, and all the things that make my people happy. That's all you can have? Okay, there you go. Another tourist ship with three people in it. Okay, excellent. Now comes a colony ship with... Yep, um, since I've split the um, difference, I'm getting an even amount of both of them coming through. And it doesn't seem to be making... No, it's, it's just the, it's the steel shortage. That's the... I said steel again. The metal shortage. That's interrupting my gun and superconductor production. Yeah. I could really use another telescope, though. But I need the power systems they're supposed to be working on over here as well, so... That's tying up all of my metal. I require workers by the truckload. Actually, the, the, the multi-dome requires metal as well for a lot of its stuff, so... Hmm. Anyway. I need more slaves. I mean, minions. I mean, uh, indentured servants. I mean, workers. Yes. That's what I mean. So, that'll help with my metal problem. And then the multi-dome over here to help people make happier... I can put video screens and drinking fountains, but I've got those elsewhere. I've got plants elsewhere as well. What was that I was just hearing? Oh, 50 coins, thank you. Did I hear someone... Well, that was really close, wasn't it? I thought I heard something. 